district considering potential changes to its cell phone policy. It would require students to turn in their devices at the beginning of each class period. That's a lot of people talking. 12 News reporter Gabriela Hernandez shares more about this policy and some of the community response. New at 6. That buzz goes off or a beep goes off, it sends dopamine to your brain. The, the scary part is, is it's not a lot different than drug users who are addicted to something. Cell phones, a hot topic of discussion at a recent Hillsborough School Board meeting as the district looks to introduce a new cell phone policy. Hillsborough Superintendent Clint Corby says the policy aims to combat distractions in the classroom. When students have cell phones in their hands, they are distracted. If their brains aren't ready to accept information, we're not able to help them learn as much as they can and get ready for the real world. One Hillsborough High School graduate I spoke with says it's not uncommon for teachers to experience hardship when it comes to students using their devices. Very rare that they will simply hand it over. They try to negotiate with you. They try to say, oh, I'll keep it away. I won't bring it back out. Um, and as an adult, you know that that's likely not going to be the case. While Bartell does think enforcements are needed, she says the policy does come with some concerns. If there was some kind of active threat in the schools, I have a sister in high school and I completely agree it would, I would be concerned and I would want to know where she is if she's safe and all of that. Um, personally, I feel like before the larger issue of threats to the school can be included, you have to think about the day to day that they are distracting to the students. In Hillsborough, Gabriela Hernandez, 12 News. The board will officially present the new policy in May with a vote scheduled in June.